Audi JPY. Let us, let us look at Audi JPY. This is one of the pair you don't want to be on the wrong side. Why? Because when it starts trending up, it goes so many pips before it retest. You can see this for our, you can see how it is stretched. Let's see how many pips. Mm -hmm. Let's see how many pips. It went almost 800 pips before it did a proper retrace. So how did JPY don't hope in on a reversal, hoping to get a reversal if you don't have a confirmation. So we can see on Audi JPY after this stretch, the market may be retracing. Guys, this might not be a reversal. Sometimes Audi JPY may retrace, may do deep retracement like this. So what, what did I do to think maybe this can be a just a deep retracement? I used my trend line strategy for me to know what is happening with Audi JPY. So this being my 4-hour, I don't need to analyze on 4-hour because I will not get the clear picture. So let me go to monthly chart. Let's do it quickly. So on monthly chart, I have a trend line here. I can put, I can be able to see 2020, 2020 market. So I can put my trend line like that. And you see guys, if you're on a 4-hour chart, you cannot be able to put that trend line because the price is very far. And maybe let's put a trend line there like that. So I have two trend line at monthly. That's what I can see or I can be able to. That's what I can be able to manage. Let's go to weekly time frame. Let's go to weekly time frame. The weekly time frame, this is what we have. You can see we have the market. This is a strategy called three, three touches. So if the market touch the third time, it has to move and move very fast and make um, a big move. So you can see here, that was first touch. And now we got the third touch and the market has never come back to this trend line. So never ignore. This is first attempt, second attempt. That attempt on the trend line, the price just moved up. It moved with how many pips? 1,604. So the, the strategy on the trend line is that if you notice that your trend line has been touched, one, two, the third time, be careful because if it decides to get rejected, the price will move very fast. If it breaks, the price will go down very fast. So, uh, let me undo the yellow. So, on the weekly time frame, I can also connect another trend line because I need one like that. So, that's what I have on the weekly time frame. Now let's go to daily time frame. You can see on the daily time frame, the same thing happened. This is first touch, first touch, second touch, the third touch, the market went up. So that's what I've been doing on the trend line strategy, putting my trend line in place. So that if they attach three times, I know the market will react. And now we have that trend line. You see, you could not have gotten this trend line perfectly if you didn't do top-down analysis. So this is to show you what G, uh, AU, AG, <laughs> AUD JPY it is doing. AUD JPY. So... You can see clearly, guys, what do we have here? Again, the same strategy. We have first touch. And then this is second touch. And yesterday, we had that touch. What do you think will happen? Will the market finally break? And if it breaks, it will come here. Or will it get rejected? And the buyers push the market even higher to make a new high. So what do you think will happen, guys? 
at this moment, the move that it will be decided, it will be very, very tough. So there's an opportunity for Audi JPY to either go down or go up. I'm not saying that if it's that, that is automatically a rejection and the market will buy. The sellers can really push that this market and it breaks. Once it breaks here, it will come to this trend line. Once it once it breaks that trend line, it will come to this trend line. So at the end of the day, where do you think this market will go? And the best the best thing to do at this moment, yes, you know, you are aware. What I'm telling you is that be aware that it's that attempt. Third attempt. On the third attempt, on the third attempt, something big, something major will happen. So let's go to four hour time frame. Let's go to four hour time frame. And you can see how the price has not been moving away from the trend line. So all you need to do is to start with price action and marking your high highs, high lows, low lows, and start identifying what the market is doing. So you can see here, the market, this is our low. Where the market has reached on the trend line, that's our low. It is very clear, defined. This is my low. So where is the my last high? Where the, the buyers could not push further. So you can see the buyers were kept pushing, but they are rejected, creating low highs. But I'll call this my high because that's the previous high that the buyers have tried to push the market i can only i can only know that the trend line has rejected uh, the sellers if buyers push if buyers push this market breaking this high and retesting back i can know that the market will continue to go up and i will be targeting the that the 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 highest point of that price. So all of these are low high, low high. Even this is a low high, but I like call, calling it a high so that if it if at all it is broken, I can have a high high. So that's how I would trade Audi JPY. I'm eagerly waiting for the buyers to break. And guys, if these buyers break this ceiling, the only thing that you need to wait now it's a retest because remember they can break and then still come down and break the trend line. So guys, make sure you wait for retest. Why? It is not a guarantee. If a resistance is broken, the market will go up. What if the market reaches here and starts coming down and break? If they break on the downside, and this is what I'm telling you guys, if they decide to break on the downside, again, wait for res for 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 retest at the trend line and target the next trend line you see everything is fine here everything is defined when you use trend line strategy so guys this was a trend line strategy showing you the an opportunity on audi jpy you can would add it to your watch list right away and start um start being familiar with it before the opportunities happen those who use moving average you can use it as a added confirmation you can see my moving average this 20 ma the 20 ma is just at the point where i want my market to break so if you have your high getting broken the market is above 20 ma what else do you need to know that the market has it was just a retest so this might not be a reversal because many people think the market will go down there. Yes, it can if it breaks this trend line. But with a trend line strategy of three touches attempt, you can see the market has touched this trend line and we are on the third touch. What do you think will happen? Will the market break up? For me, I cannot say where the market will go because it can do two things. So what I do, I wait. Patience, guys. You have to wait. Be patient. Wait for the market to give you direction. If this market will go and break here, if it will break, well and good. Wait for retest. And we will be targeting how many pips? From where it breaks, it's 287. 
if it decides to break on the downside it's how many pips 313 so either way you will get your pips thank you so much for watching guys love you love you so much until next time bye bye